Hello and welcome to a Suntup unboxing. A very nice Suntup unboxing, courtesy of their. Oh, I was gonna rip through it, but I guess I can just rip it off that way. Courtesy of the Suntup Dinged Book Sale. Don't need that. Uh, this, my friends, is The Collector by John Fowles. The Artist Edition. It is a dinged artist edition, but uh, one of the funny things, not that's funny, I guess, but one of the things about Suntup is that uh, with such a high level of quality for these Suntup editions, sometimes you can hardly see a ding. So we're going to see if we can find the ding. Anyways, you do get your nice little bookmark there. Uh, so it's The Collector by John Fowles, Introduction by Bradford Morrow, and Illustrations by David Alvarez. We'll put that on the side. I did unbox the numbered edition a few weeks back. So please consider... Checking that out. So first off the bat, oh, there's the ding. That's not terrible. It's an actual, it is a ding. But, I mean, all things considered, we're going to see how the book looks. I mean, that's just a slipcase. So we have the slipcase here for the collector. Uh, it has a corkboard look to it, but it is not actual cork like it was in the numbered edition. Uh, but I do like the slipcase still. Very nice. And, oh, we got to cover up a little bit there. We have our dust jacket featuring, uh, I think it's Tom Adams was his name, who did the, oh, whoop, cover up there, get a little nip slip, who did the dust jacket illustrations, uh, not illustration, for the uh, paperback edition. Let me take this off, off screen. Protect your eyes. I'll show you the inside of the dust jacket. That's how the inside looks. There's a nice little picture of John Fowles, who passed away back in 20, 2005. Tom Adams, yes, 1964. Uh, I believe it is Steve, who knows every artist in the world, over on the Suntup, edi uh, Suntup Editions fan group, posted that he had one of the artist prints of that cover. Really cool looking. Uh, the book itself looks very nice without the, uh, the jacket. It does have a little bit of a ding up on the, you know, the bottom and the top. So this is the most dinged I've ever gotten from a Suntup, but this was actually, like, it was it was marked as dinged. So I knew going in that it would be dinged. But, I mean, if that is the extent of the dingage, that and the corner of the slipcase, I still think I got a pretty good deal. Uh, copies of this are still available at the retail price, which are the non-dinged editions. There's the collector on top. Nice end papers there. Uh, throughout the inside, we do have illustrations from David Alvarez. There is the wonderful Trent Reznor illustration. It is not actually Trent Reznor, but damn, does it look like him. Introduction by Bradford Morrow. And uh, illustrations, abund uh, uh, illustrations throughout. Uh, one thing I mentioned in the numbered edition is that there were citations. He cited his work, which is, that's how you could tell that he is a very professional uh author there. He's like, he's writing an essay. He's quite literally writing an essay and citing his work. Uh, so the story is about a young man who becomes infatuated with an art student, a teenage female art student, and decides, you know what? Even though I collect butterflies, I'm going to collect her in my basement. So yeah, he kidnaps her and puts her in the basement. And I don't know too much else about it. I haven't read the story yet. But now that I have this incredibly dinged, I'm kidding, of course, it's not It's not terribly dinged at all, but now that I have this artist edition, I'm going to give the artist edition a read, because then you get the full effect from Alvarez, Alvarez's illustrations, and since it is the artist edition, it is signed by David Alvarez, and I love that signature, I mean, I saw the signature on the numbered edition as well, but like, that's just fancy, That's you can tell it's an artist signature. But uh, I'm loving, I'm loving the illustrations. It's, it's kind of got, you know, nice little, not doodle, but it, it's almost like a charcoal, black and white kind of illustrations that he has going on throughout. Uh, but I did also buy a dinged copy of Guests by, uh, oh my God, Keelan Patrick Burke, uh, the numbered edition. There we go. I'm going to show you that much of the cover illustration without the nip slip. And uh, I bought the the numbered edition because I had sold my numbered edition. So I was like, ah, you know what? I sold them pre-sale because I had the artist edition coming as well. And then 
Paul announced this very big dinged sale. And uh, so I picked up the collector, the artist edition, for much cheaper than retail, like less than half the cost of retail. So if that little ding and a couple little dings on the book constitute less than half of retail price, hell, I'll take it. Um, and then after having guests, the numbered edition in my hands, and it was it was a very nice numbered edition, uh, I saw that on the sale for like over 66% off. So I, uh, I picked up that one as well. I don't know if I'll do the unboxing. I mean, we could do the unboxing. I'll do it separately. It was shipped separately. That's what the notes said, in addition to having all of my information on it. And, um, yeah, I mean, I could do the unboxing. So uh, if you want to see if we can spot the defect. The defect they mentioned was they didn't come with a slipcase. But then I just went online and bought a, a slipcase for it. So I figured I got... You know, a numbered edition and the numbered slipcase for still less than half what the numbered edition was. So, as, as goofy as it seems, I had purchased it and then sold it back in the pre-order stage, but I've acquired it again. So, there'll be a separate unboxing on the channel if you care to watch it. Uh, that one arrived as well, but I'll do it as a separate video. This one's already six and a half minutes. Anyways, copies of The Collector are still available on Suntup, suntup.press. I believe... Did the numbered edition finally sell out? The numbered edition was hanging on there for a while. I know the artist edition is still definitely available. The numbered edition might be available too. Uh, I did not actually check before watching, you know, starting the recording. But if it is, you can pick up copies. I did unbox the numbered edition on my channel if you want to see that one firsthand. But thank you very much for watching. Thank you, Paul, for slightly dinged, but still immaculate i've got non-dinged books from other publishers that are more dinged than this so thank you paul for such a wonderful sale thank you guys for watching and we will see you around next time